Pickup trucks are kind of like belly buttons. Everyone seems to have one nowadays. And if you want to get into the pickup game on a budget, there are a ton of available options. But which ones are the ideal trucks for under 5K? Well, I got you. Here are four reliable trucks and an honorable mention that'll tow what you need to tow and haul what you need to haul, as long as you don't need to haul ass. Let's go. Not everyone needs a full-size truck. So let's start off with one of my favorites, and it's a reliable mid-size option. This is the Silverado's little brother, the Chevy Colorado, and it's a fantastic option and almost as capable. Now we did cover the Chevy Colorado in the video about used trucks that you should never buy. So if you haven't seen that video yet, I highly recommend you watch it. But the thing is in that video, we covered the early 2000 Colorados. But see, in 2007, they offered the facelifted version with both an inline four and inline five cylinder, which were decently peppy and they were great on fuel economy, up to 25 miles per gallon. But if you're looking for reliability, which you definitely should, you wanna get the inline five. And the fact that you can get this 2008 Chevy Colorado LT crew cab with four wheel drive and the inline five for under five grand is deals on deals on deals. And the thing that I love about crew cabs is that if you squeeze a bit, you can fit five adults rather uncomfortably but four for sure, which definitely isn't bad when you have the bed in the back for a mid-sized truck. Let's keep it in the family, shall we? Because one of the best values out there right now are the Chevy Silverados, the full-size light-duty pickup truck manufactured by General Motors since 1998. Now in 2002, they got a facelift for the 2003 model. So here's the older one, and here is the facelifted one. Even though it's a subtle change, I think that the newer version really makes the truck look a lot more contemporary. Now you wanna get any engine as long as it's the 5.3 liter Vortec V8. And lucky for you, they made a lot of these trucks. So finding one shouldn't be that difficult. Like this white 1500 extended cab with the Vortec V8. Not a bad looking truck for five grand. For the price, a full size Silverado is tough to beat. Which brings us to the ideal question of the day. If you were an animal, what kind of animal would would you be and why? A lot of auto manufacturers named their models after animals. Lamborghini with the bulls, Ford with the electric crossovers they call the Mustang. So yeah, in the comments, let us know what type of animal you would be and why. Let's go. So the Ford F-150 has been America's best-selling truck for the last 40 years years. And the 11th generation built from 2004 to 2008 is the one that you want to get. Now these F-150s came with a 5.4 liter that had a ton of issues. So if you're looking for reliability, stay far, far away. And instead snag one with a 4.6 liter V8, which yeah, isn't going to be as peppy, but it's not going to give you the headaches either. And this 06 F-150 XLT Super Crew is quite the value for under 5K. And the Ford F-150 has been dominating the competition for decades. But I wonder what's gonna happen when we all convert to electric. And trucks like the Cybertruck start taking market share. Get out the popcorn because I don't know if the F-150 is gonna be the number one truck for that much longer. And either way, it's now time for that honorable mention, baby. The reason that the Toyota Tundra is the honorable mention is because I'm suggesting the first generation of their full-size rig, which I normally shy away from. But when the Tundra was introduced to the American market, it was nominated as North American Truck of the Year. And they had a couple of engine options. The 3.4 liter V6, which also was in the Toyota Tacoma, and this all new 4.7 liter V8 the first V8 for a Toyota pickup. And guess what? Although it was their first V8, it's actually a great motor. And here's an 03 SR5 V8 extended cab for five bucks under 5K. And it does look great in white. But if you wanna learn how to knock off more than just the asking price, definitely check out the negotiation tactics I outlined in the ideal car strategies. I think Toyota did a great job with not only the design, but also staying true to their Toyota reliability with the first gen Tundra. The Toyota Tacoma is one of the least depreciating vehicles ever made. And 
for good reason. With good looks and a quality ride, this mid-sized Japanese pickup swung way above its weight. And reliability should be the taco's middle name. Because you can just beat on these trucks and they will just keep on going. Now you have to choose between three engines, the 2.4 liter, the 2.7 liter, and the 3.4 liter V6. And honestly, you can't go wrong with any of them. I would just make sure that you snag one with a manual transmission because they are way more fun to drive. And if you search hard enough, you can find them for under 5K like this 014 four wheel drive extended cab. And you'll have a reliable rig for years. Just promise me this, you'll never race any of these five sleeper trucks. Or check out the video about, well, what YouTube recommends you watch next. Oh, and if you haven't yet, please subscribe. But either way, you can't lose. And as always, keep living that ideal lifestyle.